Well guys, this is the modification that I made to my toy and engine in my six wheeler after these tiny little bearings you can see them they actually fell apart and I was lucky it didn't destroy the whole engine because the shrapnel and rubbish inside was unbelievable so I don't think that those two bearings are man enough for the job so and it wasn't running very well either so I made up a bronze bush you have to put a sleeve on there first so you have to make 5mm inside diameter, 6mm outside diameter silver steel sleeve then harden it and I push it over the crank pin use a little bit of Loctite um, bearing fit leave that for a couple of hours then I make myself a bronze bush after I've knocked the bearings out actually if you just heat the comrade up they just fall out so you don't have to bash them or anything like that then you make up um, a bronze bush sort of size for size 8mm OD 6mm inside ream it pile it off put that in as well with a little bit of bearing fit but you just have to push it in um, and then you get this lovely fit there's no oil and nothing on that and there's no play in it just want a tiny little bit of play just to allow the oil to get in I drilled two holes in the bottom of the crank uh, cum rods rather and just to let the oil go into the rod there are only one millimetre holes but I think it's enough and as you know in my six wheeler truck it's been running fine and I've got so much power on it now uh, and it's easy to tune and it runs fantastic uh, the other thing I know Dennis was talking about problems with the timing and these valves but my actual when my engines at top dead centre the actual you can see that the actual time mark is at the top but then they tell you to time it with the time mark at the bottom so I don't know the and the other thing I've noticed this casting here seems to be different to my other engine seem to, these two lugs here seem to be a lot higher but you know maybe they're changing bits as they go along changing the engine I don't know and also the, the pin that holds this pulley on um, and there's not so much play in it as my other one. My other one has got a terrific amount of play in it. Um, but this one seems a lot better. So I'm going to put this back together now. And uh, I'll let you know where I'll get on. See you later guys.